When you want to see if two values are equal in PHP, you can use this comparison operator, which is two equal signs. However, there's also another comparison operator which tests for equality, which is three equal signs. So what's the difference? The first operator compares two inputs and returns true if the values are equal. For example, here we're comparing two integer values and the result of this comparison is true. With this operator, the types of the values doesn't matter. So we can also compare a string to an integer like this and this will still return true. Only the values of the inputs are compared. This is called a loose comparison. You can see here in the PHP documentation how PHP will compare two values of different types when using the loose comparison operator. For example, comparing a string containing a number with an integer that's the same number as we just did returns true. The second operator on the other hand with three equal signs also does this but in addition it compares the type of the two inputs only returning true if the values and the types are the same. Again here we're comparing two integer values so this comparison will be true. If one is a string however the result of this comparison using this operator will be false as although the values match the types don't. This is called a strict comparison. And here is how PHP compares two values using this operator. For example comparing a string containing a number with an integer of the same number this time returns false. So when should you use one operator or the other? Let's look at an example. Here we have a simple PHP script. After the HTML header we have a form with a text area that contains some text, a text input for searching and a submit button. Below this in PHP when the form is submitted we're using the strpos function to perform a very basic search to see if the search string is found in the text and we're printing out a message accordingly. The documentation for the strpos function tells us that this function returns an integer which is the numeric position of the string within the other if it's found and boolean false if the string wasn't found. Let's give this a try. If we have the text hello world and we search for the word world we get the message that it was found as expected. If we try with another word like fish we get the message that it wasn't found again as to be expected. However watch what happens when we search for the word hello. This string exists in the text so we should get the message saying that it was found. We don't though it says not found. So what's going on? What we're doing to show the message is compare the value returned by the strpos function to false. If it's false the string wasn't found as the documentation says. Let's try and debug this. So in addition to the message let's print out the result from the function call to using var dump. Let's search again for world and we get an integer value of 6 which is where the search string starts in the text. Let's try hello again and we get 0. This is correct as the character positions start from 0. We're still getting the wrong message however. When we compare this value to false we're using the loose comparison operator. If we look at the type comparison table we saw earlier we can see that with the loose comparison operator if we compare 0 to false 
we get true. So if the string is found, but the position is zero, we're comparing zero to false, so we're going to get true. This is where the problem is. PHP is converting zero to false when it does a loose comparison. Let's change this to use the strict comparison operator instead. Now, when we search for hello, we get the correct message. The function has returned zero, but this doesn't equal false when we use the strict comparison operator. If we search for a string that doesn't exist, then we get false, which does equal the literal value of false when we compare it. This is actually mentioned in the Stripos documentation. This could return values which evaluate to false. So when comparing its return value to false, you should always use the strict comparison operator. So always be careful when using comparison operators like this. Unless you're sure the two values you're comparing are the same type, it's good practice to always use the strict comparison operator. And always check the official PHP documentation to make sure you know what values a function returns.